Line up for the final. Dan Bewley on the inside. Gate number two is Leon Madsen. Gate three is Smarslik. And uh, Lingwin will go from the outside in the final race of the 2024 Grand Prix season. It's been a smashing night. I do hope you've enjoyed it. Drama on this, though. Real, real tension in the air. Robert Lambert, as I say, he will be really frustrated if the silver medal slips away from him. Ten-point lead coming into the final round tonight. Freddie Lindgren with a desperate result two weeks ago in Voynes. Just three points. Couldn't believe what happened. But by golly, has he worked hard and there's every chance of him doing it now. Yeah, he took four confidently. I've got to say, he did when he stood there on gate four. He did take a big intake of breath. I think he realises just how brave he's going to have to be in that yeah. first turn. Because yeah. he knows he's not going to make a clear start and get across. No, he's, he's going to have to do what he did in the semi-final again. This man out of gate number three. Can he do something a little bit better? Bike hasn't been working quite as well as he would like. But somehow has managed to scrape his way into the final. When you look at uh, his evening's work, he's had three third places. Then... Yeah, so um, uh, there's no doubt that uh, Smarslik has shown terrific resolve. The five points from his last two qualifiers have uh, proved to be absolutely vital, otherwise he wouldn't have been in the semi-final. You've got to think that they've, they've made some changes between the semi-final and the final. They've got to throw him something at it. Yeah, maybe they changed the bike, because that bike he's riding, it's like a rodeo out there, you know. Every time he hits any grip, I mean, it just literally lurches up in the air. He's uh, having to hang on to it. I think, as I said before, it's all about his commitment and his determination. It's not a fresh bike. So uh, well, it's the same one. It's the same one. And indeed it is. Brian Carger there, just uh, keeping an eye on Leon Madsen. Madsen up for a win. As Abby Stevens was uh, informing us, he's finished third in the last two seasons here in Torren. Leon Madsen. And uh, Madsen is uh, a rider that can uh, win races and win Grand Prix. He's not frightened to do that. And this would be a great way to finish his campaign. But the man on the outside, so much interest in him now, Freddie Lindgren. Can he snatch the silver medal away from Robert Lambert? First or second, that's enough. I say enough in the final, <laughs> but uh, that's, the, uh, that's, the, that's the challenge for Freddie Lindgren now. Yeah, this is, uh, is going to be a great way to end this series here in Torren. And uh, Smarslik, he's got a lot of work to do. We have. Three. We've got a multiple Grand Prix winner, of course, in Dan Bewley. He uh, slipped up last time he was in the final, but he has won Cardiff this year. He is uh, a very, very good performer in finals, has a fabulous record. He often wins them. He's back out in the final here again here this evening. Leon Madsen's won here previously, of course. And Bartosz Marslik has won last year, so he's looking back-to-back -back Grand Prix. But for Freddie Lindgren, this is a huge moment, moment yeah. and a proud moment. You know, like, the way he's bounced back after that desperate night in Voynes is, uh, is remarkable. Yeah, brilliant. It, 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 you know, that's the measure of the guy, that's what he goes and does. But um, interesting to see that Smarslik's the only multi-winner here in Torrent. He's the only one to win more than one. He's won three. Yes. So that's quite impressive. Yes, most things about him are, aren't they? Yeah, it's... Um, uh, difficult to sort of pick holes in him but uh, tonight, tonight if you're going to be really really fussy about him Buck's not been working at no. all but that's all the more credit to him <laughs> absolutely he's actually managed to battle his way through into the final so for the final time in 2024 we've got four riders out on track in the grand prix they are making their way round to the start line for the final here in torrent it's been a terrific night of speedway I do hope you've enjoyed it. It's going to be a terrific conclusion, you would suggest. And then we will have all the presentations to bring to you after the conclusion of the next four laps. And uh, Dan Bewley, who has uh, recovered from the exclusion earlier on, and he will go from the inside gate in the red helmet colour. Leon Madsen out of gate number two in blue. Bartosz Marslik out of gate three in white. And Freddie Lingwin electing to go from the outside in the yellow helmet colour. Stunning ride from Lingren around the outside in the semi-final to win it, to get to this stage. As you say, he took a big, deep breath as he came did. forward and thought, OK, I've got to do it again if I want to be second in the world in 2024 behind that man. He's already the champion. He clinched that two weeks ago in Denmark. OK, so, Kel, while these guys let the clock run down, doing a little bit of gardening, trying to find the best spot to start from, who are yeah. you going with? I'm going to go for Lingren. 
I think if he gets it right in the first corner, they just won't have enough for him down the back straight. And uh, the way he's ridden tonight, it's been a man on a mission, that's yep. for sure. Can't disagree with that. Because you've gone with Lindgren, I'll go with Bewley off gate one. OK, let's see which way it goes. We weren't very good in our tips for qualifying earlier on, that's Dreadful. for sure. We were absolutely awful. But um, uh, let's hope we're a little bit more accurate here in the last race of the season. It's been a tough second half of the year with the Olympics, and then we're having three Grand Prix in three weekends. Then on to Vines, now here completing the campaign in Torrent. Everybody up on their feet. Fantastic scenes here in the Marion Rose tonight. Brilliant. What a venue it is. Here we go then. Final here in Torrent. Green lights on, tapes are up. Away we go, roaring into the first corner. Bewley locked alongside Madsen. Madsen's got there. Got to say, De um, uh, smartly. Ruthless in the first corner. He blocked the move from Freddie Lingwood. Lingwood is out the back. Here comes Smarsley around the outside. He hits the front. Can you believe it? The world champion finding it somewhere. Here comes Freddie Lingwood as well. Madsen now back to the front. Superb speed we're here in the final. Oh, this is good for Madsen. He was really determined there. Smarsley looked like he'd made his way to the front. Here he comes up the inside. He's going to straight line it. Can Madsen now turn the bike back? Can he get his wheels in line early enough? Smarsley's got to the dirt. Oh, I think he's done it. I think it's going to stick now. Brilliant stuff for Bartosz Marsley. Really has found it tough tonight, but he's out in front. Beauty now into third place. Freddie Lingwood's going to miss out on Silver now. He's out the back. Bartosz Marsley untidy. One last blast for the world champion, and he's going to win here in Torrent. What a night for him. Can you believe it? Yes. That is a mark of a champion. Somehow finding the ingredients, the strength of mind to come through and win here in Torrent, his third win in uh, 2024. Got a feel for Lingren, he did everything he possibly could. Madsen relegated to second place. But the plaudits will be all about that man. Uh, once again, he hasn't got it all right. Like Riga, he hasn't got it right. It's been a tough night for him. But when it matters, oh, he goes and does it. He does it in style. Chris. Unbelievable. He just never looked like a winner tonight. Having to ride defensively, the bike not really working very well. But by golly, when it really mattered, he just finds an extra gear. A stunning ride and performance again from Bartosz Marsley. Bluedy coming through in the third place. Got a feel for Freddie. He must have felt that he had every chance of a silver. But Robert Lambert will hang on, hang on. to uh, the silver medal. Bartosz Marsley, stunning ride. He wins here in Torin. Leon Madsen back in second place. Dan Bewley in third. And Freddie Lingwin just missing out on the rostrum. Uh, he finished in fourth place. But uh, this man delights the home crowd. Yeah. He transcends the sport in this country. He is a huge sporting icon. And uh, that's the reason why. Yeah, yeah. Because, uh, he finds it when he really needs to. But he's convincing. Three points from three rides. No, no, no. Uh, Chris, get yeah. out of it. And the bike not working for him at all. Really struggling with it. I've got to just quickly say, whilst we applaud that man, five-time world champion, winning winning again here in Torrent for the fourth time. Madsen's picked himself up from a really nasty-looking crash and finished second in the meeting. Superb stuff from him. Can we see it again? Yeah. Look us through it. Yeah, it's a very even break, actually. Everybody makes a decent enough start. In fact, Lingren's the worst one, but of course, we've seen it from gate four, but Smarslik, importantly, gets there before him, gets into the dirt. Lingren now doesn't have a run. Madsen's done everything right. He's got the bike hooking up around the inside. He looks confident. Smarslik, look at that. Little look across Madsen. Where's he going? Is he going to leave me room? Yes, he does. He hits the front, looks good. Lingren, meanwhile, is now in in third place and he's thinking okay can I find a way between these two Smarslik gets in a bit of an uncomfortable position there that now allows Madsen back around him but then Smarslik up the inside once he got to the dirt once he got the run back down that straight he hit the front for the second time you've got to say there was no way he was going to let Madsen back past him well no indeed tight finish in the end but um, there's no doubt that Bartosz Smarslik has broken Freddie Lingren's heart there with that move in the first corner as you say he got to the dirt first that was and, important and it was hugely important and uh, there was a chance for Lingren you know he was lurking there in third place but uh, at the conclusion of the four, four laps it's Bartosz Smarslik winning here for the fourth time stunning ride from him Freddie misses out so Robert Lambert will be crowned world number two 
and uh, he will be absolutely delighted and relieved. It's been a long wait. He must have felt that it was slipping away there, but uh, Freddie missing out. He trudged off the track. He did look particularly disappointed, and you can have sympathy for that, that's for sure. So uh, we'll have a look at uh, the points handed out tonight. Schmarslick with a huge win there, 20 points for him. Leon Madsen with a good ride there, 18 points. Dan Bewley on 16, and Freddie Lingwin finishing in fourth place, 14 points for him. It's all done now. Championship is concluded. We will bring you all the facts and figures as and when they are delivered to us. But uh, right now, the top six, the top three, it's all done. And what a way to round the season out. It really has been a fantastic night. It has yeah. been a brilliant meeting because we've had pretty much everything. But I can't say enough about Bartosz Marslik. He breaks everybody's heart, doesn't he? Because they must have felt they had the edge on him tonight. But uh, the ride in the final was out of the top draw. Superb effort from him. So there's the outcome of the World Championship. Smarslik is the World Champion. Robert Lambert just hanging on there for a silver medal. Congratulations to Robert Lambert. Fine effort. Freddie Lingren in third place. Bronze for him. Bewley into fourth. Martin Vaslik fifth. Jack Holder is sixth. Mikko Mikkelsen seventh. All the best for Mikkelsen on his recovery. And Kubera finishes in eighth place. Madsen, Lebedev's Max Frick, Kai Huckenbeck, Simon Wozniak, Matze Janowski, Jankovic and Jason Doyle.